The outgoing NYXC Director of Information and Public Relations, Eddie Megwa, has commended members of the press for their prompt and accurate reportage of the scheme's activities during his tenure. Speaking at a valedictory session with journalists, Megwa urged them to maintain professional ethics and standards in verifying information with the scheme before publishing to avoid spreading misinformation. He expressed gratitude for their support, which has contributed significantly to his success as the 28th image maker of the scheme. The report. It was an emotional moment filled with good memories as the image maker of the NYC bows out of service after what can be described as successful time of service. After serving the commission for 35 years, Eddie Megua bows out amidst accolades and admiration from his colleagues and well wishes. He also took time to highlight on issues about the NYSC. Every day I open the pages of newspaper, you must see something NYSC. You go to the social media, something NYSC. Almost everybody in this nation, Nigeria, is a stakeholder in the National Youth Service Corps. And it's, the reason is very simple. If your son is not serving, your son may have served. If your daughter is not serving, she may have served, okay? Somehow your niece, your nephew, everybody is having interest in what is happening in National Youth Service Corps. Now, this shows that NYSC is doing something good, if not for anything, that parents believe that when they push these young ones to us, we are going to take good care of them. This boy confessed that he was a person. This happened in 2007, not with this guy, General. So, what he said that day was an inference. He was making reference to what happened in 2007. And that's when NYSC started raising alarm with the Ministry of Education. In fact, then the minister had to set you know, ministerial committee that will go to some institutions made up of EFCC, police, NYSC, to go around and find out what was happening in higher institutions. Yes, it happened. Yes, we addressed the issue that time. Yes, the boy was demobilized. Yes, institutions were sanctioned. And this unical issue Alarm was raised by the VC, and he, he gave me a physical, met the DG. He said, no, we can't continue this way. And we went into our system, discovered the people, and DG gave marching orders that all of them should be demobilized. The outgoing NYC Director of Information and Public Relations also encouraged youth correspondent to extend the same level of support to his successor to ensure a smooth transition and continued success in his assignment. Megwa is set to retire from public service on Sunday, August 25, 2024, upon reaching the mandatory retirement age of 60. Florence Joshua reporting for Clairview News Decks.